safety runs deep in our DNA. Our original product, the pump action vacuum cup, was developed to increase the safety of glass handling, and, and it still does. So kind of the evolution of our, our product line, um, we have a lot of lifters that do similar tasks. Historically, one of the first ones we made was the P1, and, uh, and at its time, it was a lifting 700 pounds. It was a fairly simple unit, but it was one of the first of its kind, really, and that was as, as large as we needed to be. Our most economical or, or kind of our entry level lifter is our uh, P1 lifter series. It's the four cup inline unit. So the P1 would offer 180 degree rotation in the same plane and it would offer 90 degree tilt vertical to horizontal. It'll have a 700 pound load capacity. Standard will come with the IntelliGrip system as many of our lifters will now. It's just add a, an abundance of safety features and ways to monitor the vacuum system throughout the lift so that the operators can worry a little bit less about what's going on with the lifter and a little bit more on uh, actually setting the glass. Um, it's, a, it's a great little lifter for smaller crews or for crews that are experiencing uh, workloads or, or job types that are very similar and very repetitive, not much change to them. And as glass and windows became more complicated and sprawled more, we needed to develop something that had more support. It reached out and, and dodged mullions in the glass and was able to pick pad placements instead of just have four set pads. So we developed an MRT4 for that, still at a 700 pound range because that's all we were kind of seeing in the capacity. Having the MRT4 with a more configurable pad frame allows you to do narrower pieces as you can put the cups in a straight line similar to that of the P1. You can also spread them out over the piece of a material. It will rotate 360 degrees in the same plane and will also offer the 90 degree tilt vertical to horizontal. Um, and then we saw a movement towards larger glass and, and, and so we developed the MRTA8. Uh, it was a six at that time and as we saw 1,200 and 1,400 pieces of glass. But with that becomes a more inherent safety risk. So how is the operator going to handle that glass? These are all still manually manipulated, but we had to integrate the linkage system so that the user can manipulate it with less force. And that was kind of our limit as we got larger. The MRTA8 is very versatile. It will offer six different pad configurations, where with the P1 you get the one, and the MRT4 you get roughly three. So you kind of continue to double as you move up in lifter structure. The MRTA8 will rotate 360 degrees and also tilt 90 degrees vertical horizontal, and will feature the IntelliGrip as well. For a number of years now, we've seen where there's been a demand for more higher capacity lifters. And the next step was this 2,800 pound MRPT-16. Uh, but we had to start integrating powered controls and more remote control based controlling it. As the glass gets larger and larger, not only is it hard to move around, but you can't even get to it when it's tilted. It's, you know, can be 280 by 120 inches and it's hard to get to the controls at that point. So it, it's a big jump in usability. You can't just throw on more pads. This was filling that need that we, we currently didn't have in our standard fleet. Where this MRPT-16 is really gonna shine is in its ability to tilt loads from vertical to horizontal 90 degrees. Previously, we've only had large capacity lifters that would simply allow you to rotate the glass, which oftentimes was all that was needed is large curtain wall would come in on, say, a trailer on an A-frame, and it was laying edgewise, and you just needed to rotate it upwards into the side of the building. But any more architects and big glass are becoming more and more popular and more and more difficult to install. And we've run into a lot of applications lately where somebody has had a 2,000 plus pound piece of glass that they're needing to put into a skylight. So bringing that load from vertical to horizontal uh, was really essential in growing our product line. It's very innovative on the MRPT is the load cell where it monitors when you're loaded or not and uh, prevents the operator from accidentally releasing a load before it's uh, fully supported. 
That's something that, as far as I know, is only available on our MRPT-16 lifter. The MRPT-16 will allow you to reconfigure loads in about 16 different ways. Uh, there's 16 different pad layouts that you can get from that lifter standard. Uh, and it will allow you to achieve that max 2,800 pounds capacity with all 16 pads in use. If you reconfigure the frame and allow it to only support four of the 16 pads, uh, then you would achieve a 700 pound capacity and be able to uh, handle a much smaller piece of material, making it a very versatile unit from something that might be a once every you know, three, six, nine month job to something you can utilize day in and day out. You can purchase the MRPT-16 as the lifter in a base model, or you can also purchase it with what we call our integrated counterbalance. So this integrated counterbalance that um, is part of the unit uh, will actually allow you to swing an arm outward and be able to maintain the balance of the load. Again, it will gain you a slight amount of clearance to get under an overhang, but the intent of the integrated counterbalance on the MRPT-16 is not so much for eave clearance, but for load balance and uh, an ease of getting that glass to the, to the set point of the building. Now the new app that allows for remote monitoring giving your crane operators or your guys that are doing the install up in the building the ability to monitor the status of the lifter at, at all times during the lift. Again, that's, that's something that is only available through Woods Power Grip and, and the new DC-3 IntelliGrip lifters that we're operating. Flying a piece 30 stories in the air, how do you maintain visual on those vacuum gauges to know that everything's okay in the system? That's where we developed the IntelliGrip app. Um, to be able to watch those gauge levels as they fly from point A to point B and you can rest assured that 30 feet in the air um, or you know, however many feet in the air that by watching the monitors or the vacuum gauges you're getting an accurate reading throughout your entire lift uh, on how that system is performing and how that vacuum system is maintaining its ability to ultimately maintain the load. We had to make it safe, we had to make it easy to use and we had to make it uh, affordable. So we try to keep a, a very sober mindset that doing a good job in a, a vetted design is a life and death situation. And are really committed to trying to engineer and manufacture the safest product on the market. Safety. 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 It's been at the core of all of our innovation.